A vicious attack caught on video leads school officials in the Oxford Hills region to close for the next couple of days. Good evening, everyone. I'm Lindsay Mills. And I'm Pat Callahan. We want to warn you that the video you're about to see is pretty graphic. It apparently shows students beating up another student, and it prompted police to take some drastic measures. The video, which has been viewed hundreds of times on Facebook, appears to show a group of students fighting. At least two students continue to punch and kick another student on the ground. New Center Maine's Zach Black Blanchard has the latest from the town of Paris. Yeah, as of right now, at least two students have been charged. If you take a look, that video captured over the weekend and shared to Facebook has now been viewed hundreds of times. It forced school officials and police to make students learn remotely at both the high school and middle school through at least tomorrow. According to police, more videos of similar behavior have surfaced and more arrests are likely. But parents here, well, they are outraged. They say this kind of thing has been swept under the rug for too long and their children deserve to feel safe. It's not funny. Someone's going to die. And what are we going to do? Like, we all need to get together as a community and help these kids be better people. We're still continuing uh, several interviews. There are just so many people involved, um, several different versions of events that took place. So trying to sift through all that information and the number of people involved is, is tasking. Now we're told the teen who was injured was taken to the hospital and now is recovering at home. As for classes, they're expected to stay remote at least through Wednesday. In Paris, I'm Zach Blanchard, New Center, Maine.